Notable personalities and gospel ministers from different denominations visited the residence of late evangelist Felicia Naiwu to condole with her children and family members over the demise of their mother. The visitors, who include members of Christ Apostolic Church of God Mission, business associates, management of Hotel Felona and Feli Gold, staff of Humphrey Christian Academy, led by the head mistress Lady Victoria Okori, were received on arrival by Edison son of the deceased, Reverend Lucky Onaiwu. They described the late industrialist and philanthropist Evangelist Felicia Onaiwu, popularly called Mama Tota, as a caring woman who impacted positively on the lives of many at home and in diaspora. A regime, an entrepreneur of the highest order. Whatever I am today, whatever Christ Fellowship Church is today, is because of Mrs. Mommy was so kind to us and all the staff in the Hotel Felona and it was a mother to us. She's so lovely. She's a lover and mother of everybody. She's a lover of children. And whenever you see her, she's, she always has a listening ear. We are going to mix Mama, not only me, every other person, both home and abroad, they are going to mix Mama. He is a lover of children. He is... When you are around her, you never go hungry. She was an epitome of love, an epitome of humility that would, whoever that comes her way will know that of a truth she is a woman of God. Eldest son of the deceased and senior pastor, House of Favor International Church, Reverend Lakiana, who said his mother will forever be missed. He said after due consultation with family members, dates for her funeral will be announced. She was not just a blessing to herself or to her immediate family. I want to say that she was a blessing to her generation. So I can pride myself in the fact that I had a mother that was a blessing to her generation. So I give all the glory to God. It's quite painful anyway, but this is somebody that is so close to my heart. Everything has been about my mother. So it's a new journey in my life. By the grace to cope, I know God will grant me and I will be a success story indeed in Jesus' name. Evangelist Felicia Onagu, who died at the age of 78, was known for her entrepreneurship and philanthropist Rosalind Eworame reporting.